this be an item screen. We're finishing, but we started. This is the extra part that I promised you guys to finish the fillers. And I'm gonna, because I have more than enough time, and let's add the extra balls in it. I mean, the extra ending. Okay, here we go. Good. And this time, I'm prepared. I'm just gonna fight him regularly. Regularly. There's no point in attacking from the front, you have to attack him from the side. Each of them have a certain trick behind like, You know what? Let's experiment. Nope. What? Screw it. We're not gonna find any special tricks. No, Nintendo had to hit them somewhere. There's no point in cornering, corner fucking him. There is no trick to these bastards. You know what? See, Hammer Smack does nothing. Does magic work on him? Nope. Oh, that's a trick to beating him. Rinse and repeat. Rinse and repeat. This is pretty much cheating though. But who cares? This boss with this boss is retardedly hard. Oh it did and here to start here your strategy has to change because Nintendo was smart enough to give him now stuff that he can use to do something against your damn tricks. We don't even we need any potions for this battle. No. Quit it. Uh uh. Oh, yeah, this one punishes you for doing that. See, he tries to shoot you. He makes another opening. Uh uh. Life minutes of you quick. God, he won't die. Why does the purple one have to be the epic one? Why did the green one? Why did the red one or the blue one? No, it had to be purple fuck. Purple Nurple. Quit it! God, he's not, not even being... No! You can rarely hit them. God, stop! Mm. Oh. Fuck you. Finally! Can you stand there? Da, 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 da. You cleanse the evil of the Four Sword Palace. And I like. We get the secret ending? Yes, we get a secret ending. Look at those plans dance. While well, Kiki is juggling rupees. The rupees you gave Kiki. And for some reason, the Swamp Palace and the Marbles are being bombed by those mushrooms. See, look at those moments like, eek, eek, eek. Mm. Oh yeah, for some reason he's panicking and throwing stuff at the level 3 wood because those things that eat your items are now going to eat the stuff of the moblin. <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. Thieves start thieving each other. They're like, hey, you get items. Give me items. And no, this changes each time. At least, they're not following a certain pattern. Only a few do. Revisor is shooting the ice towers for some reason. 
mutate off rock shooting the ice power once again. Like the uh, the vault. Mm, is there a misery mire? Well pretty much these do nothing. Just those things flying over like always. But yeah, they spawn a rat see someone wanna spawn out of the thing. It's a little bit glitched. He sees Link and those are just the Chimera shooting and the Moblin's like, oh look, oh look. And of course, they're happy too. For some unknown reason. And Gans are just not being invaded. And look at them, they're juggling bombs. This one's the same always. Just a few of those patterns change sometimes due to the AI coding. Oh boy, what is he going to do with that big bomb at Ganon's place? Well, you can guess. Ganon's going to go boom. Well, not, you don't get to see that, but you get the impression. Yeah, and his mask go off. Oh yeah, Argus. That's his face. This is the simple version. The other ones are just two. Then, I'm not going to have to show every form though. Fail of a boss. Even these two versions of Fail of a Boss is just slightly more annoying, but the heart of the first one is the stage and the second one is just annoying. Blind. Ugh. The first or the second, it doesn't matter. Both of them are bad. You saw how much trouble I had in the first part. Cold turn. <laughs> Not really an hard boss, more like an annoying boss. Oh yeah, Vitorious. This boss is just very annoying. Look at it. That's it. A little two farms. Simple boss. Trinex. Oh, annoying thing. Which is retardedly easy. Yeah, they're shooting each other. I'm not doing anything. My joystick, my joypad's on the ground. And of course, Ganon. At the end, twirling his little fire. Teleport. Now, we get a fun part of this game. So it cheated, so it's probably not going to make any sense what it's going to say, because I didn't do it, but pretty much it keeps your quest log. What does the quest log mean? It checks how many, how many times you use your bow and arrow, how many times you use your boomerang. Yeah, every item you use is being counted. Hookshot. Bombs. Magic powder. Almost none. Sorry, but even in my original play, we didn't do that. Fire rod, that's low. I would use it a lot more. I brought four times. Burning Bunny Trinex. I use it a little more. Bombo, zero use. I only use it once for both at E3. I gotta use it a lot for some ruby farming. Like, only if it's too much. Not really something you would use. That's a lot of lamp usage. Magic hammer, makes sense. Flutes, makes sense. I would use it 100 times though. But catching it, I would use it a lot more. I'm not kidding. Book of Mudora. Mudora, whatever. Makes sense. Shovel. You would use it a lot to just farm thrive. Kane of Summer Tire is supposed to be way more, unless this guy was a speedrunner. Kane of Bryna. Which is an invincibility, same as the Magic Cape. But Bryna just damages your opponent, Magic Cape does nothing. I love that Kane. I use it more. Magic Mirror, that makes little sense. Yeah, that, those are my usage. Magic medicine, I can barely use those. I do use, yeah, cure alls. I would use that too. Four times. Makes sense. Super Bomb, I would use it also only once, maybe a few times more. The off is supposed to be way higher. Pegasus Boots. Yeah, I would use that. That would probably be your most used item. More than your sword. Probably as much as your sword. Sword Flippers. Look at the sword count. Even in my original quest, I didn't get that far. How many times saved? Well, considering how many times I saved, it's all makes sense. Whoa, this guy used a lot of fairies. 
Even I use less than that. Ha! I've already beat that in my original save file, which I do not have because it's an original copy. I slayed a lot more enemies, just roll holes. And of course my playtime was a little higher. But there you go! Instead of crits, you get to see what you did. And in the end you get to see how many total deaths. That's it. And of course log. You can speed it up a little, nothing happens, you have to reset the game from here. So, how do we still some time? Let's just... Yeah, excuse me of this. I'm just the guy who decoded it. It must have been a banana. There we go. Yeah. Or so it's a file, which you can use. I pressed the mode button. This from the last plot I say, which is actually right where, right where I left off. I'm going to show you real quick how to beat Ganon. Because I have no trouble with Ganon whatsoever, at least on my original safe I could almost perfect him. I actually did perfect him once. He's good use of his patterns. He'll just kill him real quick. No! Twice! No, 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 no. You see this 100 times. You're not here for the dialogue. No. uh Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck. Ow. Okay, that's a bad start. Luckily, I brought this one along. I normally do better, but. That doesn't work on him. That's mostly how I hit him. Damn it, I dodged that. Oh, teleporting ass. He doesn't let you hit him. You have to give him a moment. Yeah, I hit him twice during that moment. It's not really very effective. Not needed or effective. That fire almost hit me. Almost always hit me. That shaking makes you temporarily invulnerable, so you can use it to dodge the flank. You son of a bitch. It doesn't make it doesn't do any extra of this. It's just I need to do. Keep your fire with me. Oh crap, I forgot I have brought no magic. However, I get a free hit. Oh you fuck! Oh, that just mean! You were on top of me! Yeah, I have to kill him with a silver arrow. Okay, now I need to get magic because or else I'm not gonna make it this battle. I can easily buy some, but nah. There we go, my magic sound. How am I gonna beat Ganon without magic? Well, we can easily slide the grass, or we can say, fuck it. I was actually two hits away from killing him anyway. By the way, it was silver arrows. In the past, it was silver arrows. There we go, that's what I needed. Oh, you! Moblin. I need to give him hearts and digging gives you faster magic. This is how the mechanic works. Don't doubt it. I don't want heart. I don't want rupees. Also, it's random. So there's not like a fixed pattern. Maybe under here or something? Nope. How about running into a tree? A little more magic. And you give me bombs. I know that. You can just kill him by throwing a bomb at him real quick. Gimme. Give Gimme. Give we get Gimme! Oh B! You know what? Okay, I'm gonna do it. You can easily beat him. You again, go away. Why do you have to still grab some music quick? Let's just beat down real quick and get this over with. Two hits for you. 
three, four, five, next phase. I will skip this phase pretty much because I hit him that much in the beginning. No, uh, I know I'm gonna get hit now. Okay, here comes the fire bullets. Where did one, that one came from? Okay, time to focus him into the next phase. Link, stop being a jerk. Stop being, stop being a jerk. Ah, ah, what? Oh, now Gannon's going to go into look at me I can warp face. You have to be careful where you make some stands because you saw what happened. It's too early every time. No, deny fire back. Just hitting him a few times actually just for lulls. This is affecting things. This fight so demanding an item. Where is he? Oh, you bastard! You spawn in my face again. And sometimes you can shoot him twice. Oh, this fight's over. Oh. Why? Ooh. Ow. Nice guy, eh? And now you'd be dead. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And I think I will leave it with this triumph. Because Link does not want the tripod today. No, I actually did an endurance round of this. An endurance challenge. Okay, you fall off and you fight Ganon again. Get it? But that's maybe for a request later. I'm done for today.